uh, I'm going to be reading the first three verses in Proverbs chapter 23. It says, When you sit down to eat with a ruler, observe carefully what is before you, and put a knife to your throat if you are given to appetites. Do not desire his delicacies, for they are deceptive food. Wow. Um, just going to do it again. When you sit down to eat with a ruler, observe carefully what is before you, and put a knife to your throat if you are given to appetites. Do not desire his delicacies, for they are deceptive food. Uh, a few notes here. Uh, number one, it says when you sit down with a ruler, right? Not if, but uh, when, when you sit down to eat with a ruler. And so you're going to meet a ruler. It may not be the top of the country, person on the top of a country. It may be. Uh, it may be the person, the head of, uh, of a company, of a church. It may be um, the person, the head of like even a department. And that might be a ruler that you sit down to, to dine with and to talk with and uh get ready for it get ready for it and i believe the proverbs is getting ready for those times okay uh and it says put a knife to your throat if you're given to appetites wow it means exercise self-control when you're sitting down with these rulers uh don't just go crazy and um do whatever your appetite wants you to do now that includes eating the food, all the food, but that also includes sharing everything you want to share and asking for everything you want to ask. Uh, so we want to be very discerning when we are with rulers to be careful how we, um, how we live, how we act, how we behave. We want to be very careful. Uh, do not desire his delicacies for they are deceptive food. Now, here's the thing as well. When you're with a ruler, you might have the appetite and the temptation to make these crazy big asks but at the same time, they might want something from you. And so that food there just might be the price uh, to try to win you over to their side, uh, to receive your services, or for you to change your priorities. And so it is very important, it is paramount that we exercise a lot of discernment when we are with rulers, with people in higher places. And man, I don't know about you, but that sobers me up. It helps me to remember not to be too impressed or expect too much from people above me, ahead of me, um, that are in powerful positions. I will be polite. I will at times make my asks. At times I will be asked certain things of myself and I'm going to be discerning, but I will be ready. Ready how? By not giving in to all my appetites and by not being sold out too easily. You know what I'm saying? When they want something from me, I'm gonna make sure that, I'm, that, that this food is not paying for me. Um, I'm going to be careful in what they ask and how I respond. So man, I'm really thankful for the word of God. Uh, it, God is definitely preparing me to talk with people in higher places and to be very discerning in the process. At the same time, to enjoy, amen? Uh, have a good time, have a great time. God is good. He's awesome. He has great, great plans for you and for me. Amen? Amen. All right. We'll see you in Proverbs chapter 24. God bless.